Okay, so I said I was gonna um, start making videos of shit. Uh -huh. and this is kind of the funniest. Like, my laptop is in my cabinet right now. Um, see if this I can really put it to like. Yeah, so you can see what's happening. Um, okay, so I'm making eggnog. I've never made it before. Um, and I'm following this fucking, like, Adaragusia recipe. Um, well, he's getting it from somebody else. He's doing his classic science shit. Um, so, you need a cup of heavy cream. Uh, it needs to be, like... Yo, this shit is so thick that it just doesn't even... It's basically, like, ice cream level. There we go, there we go. Okay, so, oh my god, it's so chunky. Okay, and it's kind of splattering everywhere, because it's... Alright. I have a chopstick to help things along. Um... Okay. So I gotta whip this. I'm basically just making whipped cream right now. Oh, yeah, but I noticed that his recipe doesn't call for, like, any spices. I was like, dude, where the fuck is the cinnamon? Like, what's happening? So I'm gonna put some salt in there. Not a ton, but... I always modify recipes, because I feel like... I don't know, there's always something about them that I'm just like... That just doesn't really make sense to me. There's always at least one thing that is missing, or that just for my personal taste, I'm like, why would you not include this? So, I'm doing like pretty classic um, kind of warming spices shit, like cinnamon, cloves, I got some nutmeg here. I could do ginger too. That might make it a little. I don't know. It's not a gingerbread thing. But, um, I'm just, I, I eyeball everything. I don't really care. But I, I will still follow the measurements of the, the base recipe. Oh my god. Um, at least until I know what I'm doing. For right now, I don't. So, um, cool. Here we go. I don't know what I'm gonna do about editing this or whatever, because, um, the audio is probably gonna be dog shit, uh, especially if I'm, have this mixing bowl, or mix, mixer, right next to the microphone. Baby! Oh! That's kicking me out. He's probably gonna start screaming. Um, uh, so yeah, this is, this is great. Um, all right. Oh, okay, big man. Did you finish your breakfast? Oh, man. He's the big boy. Here he is. Oh, his butt is dirty. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm gonna turn the shit on. There's actually a whipped cream. Okay, nine is the whipped cream setting. <laughs> All right, let's fucking go. I feel like this is gonna splatter. I'm gonna put it on nine right away. Fuck it. Look at this. Yeah, still not yet. Okay. Um, I'm gonna crack 
the eggs into here because you're supposed to this is like small bowl to set aside for whipped cream and then everything else kind of goes in this bigger bowl um but yeah this still needs some time it is getting considerably thicker though This is still, this is still like not fucking, it's not whipped. I honestly think it's not supposed to take this long. Um, and yet it is. But you know what? I think this is... God. You know... You... I need to whisk this by hand. I'm a woman. You can't even tell, but me one machine bitches zero. So this is like, can you see this? How much, um, I think it's, whatever. Just fucking trust me. Alright, so, um, so now I might as well hand whisk this one too. So now it's time for the most important part of the whole operation, the booze, doing a whole cup and a half of this. Uh, I think I can lose the chopstick now. You know, watch me say that and then I need it for something. I mean, it's not that hard to wash, it's just a, it's just a chopstick. All right. That is so much. Holy shit. Alright. We're rocking with that. And you have to slowly. Very slow. Okay. So let me get. Let me get Adam's advice over here. Uh, what the fuck? Fine. Um, slowly drizzle in to the eggs. Alright. I'm gonna start by just beating up the eggs themselves and then. You're actually chemically cooking the eggs with the alcohol. Um, 
which is why you can let this sit for like a few days to a few weeks even um, and age it. And you're killing the bacteria of like the raw shit in here. Um, okay. Then he's got another cup of unwhipped cream, but you could use milk instead. Okay, so here's where I have this. I have a considerable about, amount of uh, raw milk from the farm that um, is starting to smell. And yeah, yeah, it's starting, it's starting to smell a bit. And because I didn't use it as fast as I thought I would. And I kind of want to use it. I don't know geez, if this will kind of fuck the whole thing up, but um, that's a risk I'm willing to take. By just doing, because he says a cup of unwhipped cream, but what if I did half a cup of stank milk, half a cup of unwhipped cream? So um, I'm not totally jeopardizing the whole thing. See, is that even worth it? Because I didn't really, I'm trying to use this up, basically, is the point, but that didn't really use up much of it at all. But it's such a small amount, I don't think it... I mean, there's some alcohol in this, like... I think a little bit of stank will be just fine. Okay. So, half a cup of this. Half a cup of this. Um, so what the hell am I doing? Just whisking that in, too, and then... Okay, I think I pour this and I whisk it all up, and then I kind of gently fold the whipped cream in at the end. Yeah, that is literally what I do. So, I'll kind of get this. Get this in there. So we got this mixture, and then it's not a gentle fold, it's just kind of fucking put it in there type situation. Um, it's not like a, it's not like an egg whites or something that you don't want to deflate. It doesn't really matter. Oh my god, and here it is. Wow. So this is, so this is the nog, huh? It's that simple, eh? I think I'm gonna add a bit more cinnamon. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna add some more spices. I always end up doing this. Um, oh, see, that even looks prettier now. I think part of the idea with aging it is that you kind of let all of the flavors sort of melt together and kind of mellow out, too. Because I think if I were to drink this right now, um, it would just kind of taste exactly like you put a cup and a half of, of whiskey in there. Because that's what the fuck is in there. But... I am gonna taste a bit now. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. More cinnamon. Way more. I'm gonna screw him with that. I don't fucking care. Let's go. It's like, I can't, I just, more, more, I need fucking more, cloves. I also think, I think the coffee was a good idea, but I just didn't put enough in there. Alright. Oh, uh, not bad. I'm gonna put more of that in there too. Get fucking 
crazy. Yeah. Give it a big. Let me try and pour this without wasting any of it. Okay, here we go. Wasting it. No, no, immediately wasting it. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, fucking shit. Alright, alright. No big deal. No big deal. Oh my god! I didn't put the fucking sugar in it. That's why it tastes like this. There's no sugar in it. Can I just put the bowls in the sink? Okay, so we have some options here. The options are just dump it in here. Or I have to like I meant to do that. And I'm doing like a sugar-free eggnog. Okay. How much was I supposed to put in there? What was I actually supposed to do? I got too cocky and I didn't follow the instructions. And. Shit. Half a cup of sugar. Half a cup of sugar. So, if I were to just pour it in right now, it wouldn't really be. It wouldn't probably be mixed in all the way through. Um, so, you kind of have parts that are sweeter than others, and I think that that is not a not a great move. Oh, Alright. Okay, so my new idea presently is the chopstick. I knew I was going to need it. Yeah, so new plan is I'm going to dissolve either this sugar or maybe some honey in like a little bit more um maybe I'll do the milk. Oh no, but I don't want to put a warm liquid in here. Shit. Shit. Okay, I could do that and let it cool down a bit. Basically, I want to just have, like, make, like, a really quick, sort of, like, simple syrup almost. Pour it in here. Chopstick to get down in there and stir it all up. Um, and then save, save this fucking eggnog. Um, you know, I was wondering, like, this whole time why it tasted like shit. Um. Because I'm not paying attention to what I'm doing. Um, you know, it doesn't actually taste like shit. It just tastes unbalanced. Um, I think I am going to do the honey. Oh. And I could put some vanilla extract in there, too. That would be nice. What am I going to dissolve this in? More alcohol? No. Um, I 
I want to dissolve this in a liquid and have it be uh, dissolved. Oh, but I'm not measuring this in. Okay, eyeball. Eyeball. I got two of them. Let's go. Am I bending the cat spoon? Man. At what cost am I making this eggnog? So I'm going to start with my liquid being a bit of vanilla extract. And see how that goes. Um, maybe a bit more of the spoiling milk. Yeah, basically. That's awesome. this sit for ideally like a week. Oh no, but I'm intending on sharing this um, with my friends that are coming to stay for Christmas. Oh, which is only in three days. Whatever. I'm going to put this in the fridge. Maybe I'll check back in after it's done. Um, I think I should test it maybe after like one day. Because it says age for a few days, two weeks. Like indefinite weeks. So I think after a few days it, it would also be fine. Um, so now we wait. 